Okay, happy Labor Day. There's my winds. Not as bad as yesterday. Not as bad at all as yesterday. They were blowing a little stronger when I put, before I put it up. But it's kind of late. It's 10 o'clock, but it's not very hot. So we're flying. Got the Grand Tundra. Got the Grand Tundra, this time operating off a four cell. Basically, the winds are right down the runway. Well, what do I notice so far? I notice it doesn't have as much power. That's what I noticed just right off the top of my head. Get out here towards the runway. I came down on this end of the field for a couple reasons. One is if the sun comes back out, or the winds, if they switch, I can flip the field without being anywhere near the tower. I don't know if anybody else will come out. Since it's windy, I doubt it. Unless they just come out driving around, stop and say hi. Alright, let's see how we can go vertical here. a lot of vertical on four cell. Of course I'm you know I'm not breaking new ground here. There has been plenty of videos filmed on four cell. Funny man, it's like deja vu except for it's cooler. Got the same wind blowing off my same little cross cross winds. So we get a no flapper in here. Definitely feels lighter on the on, a, on the landing there. Landing flaps. Time to stop. Let's see if we can tell. We'll do a little stall here. Time to start. Time to stop. Time to start. The bottom's gonna fall. Time to stop. Wow. Seems lighter on our loafers. That's for sure. Seems nice. I'm still using the same prop that I had with the 6 cell. I can see what some of you guys are saying about flying around four cells. Time remaining, five minutes. Ooh. She hit the ceiling there. No, not as near as much power. I, I don't think you could mess around, and you wouldn't have that same power to get out of trouble like you got on six. Duh, Captain Obvious here. But shoot, if you just had four thousand four cells, shoot, you can have a lot of fun with this. Landing flaps. Watch that churn right there. We're past the danger zone. Get the wings producing lift again. You gotta keep them producing lift or you're gonna be in trouble. Increase the power when you take your flaps up. You're Time going slow because you lose that extra lift. I don't know how long I'm going to fly this battery. I'll check it out. 
Should have put a watt meter on it. Landing flaps. But it's definitely, even with that heavy graphene 4004 4, cell, it's still, and it, it, it reminds me of the, on 4 cells, it flies more like the regular Tundra. It's a little lighter to wing loading. It's about the same wind. If nothing else, today's wind is better than yesterday's because it, it's it's a little more steady. Yesterday you were going from 15 to time remaining three minutes. So it's just barely blowing. This always feels Nine. steady. Let's see if we can bring it up here. Oops. Bring it up. Put it on the line. Looks like the sun's coming out. I don't have my shades on. Oh no, what will I do? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Sweet. I have two 4,000 four cells. That's funny, the wind just increased the throttle. I did that on purpose, I increased the throttle. I guess we get one more. We get one more in with no flaps. Landing no flaps. Still feels like we got plenty of chip if I need it. It's going stronger. I think they're getting ready to switch. About this time last day, they switched. It's still mostly blowing off my back as I roll down the runway. So, oops. All right. Fire up here. Watch out if the wind doesn't bring it down unexpectedly. Bring it over a little rudder. Oh, oops. A little too much rudder. <laughs> that was no flap. That was a pretty doggone good stall landing with no flaps. Well, there you have the four cell. I guess, I guess I'm going to bring it over here. I didn't bring my temperature gun out. So it'd be kind of foolish to put it on it if I gotta go all the way back to the car. All terrain driving here. Alright. Let's see, let's test the let's fill the ESC. Oops. Yeah, I programmed that off switch. I did that. put last night or the other day when I was doing my batteries I put hooks on I bat I never put hooks on the batteries I don't know what the heck got into me right. ESC shoot ESC is warm barely warm the motor barely warm barely warm so I'd say that prop Prop works well on four cell and six cell. Again, I don't know the size off the top of my head. You'll have to look at the uh, Cessna 170 prop. But I think it's the same as the four cell. It's, uh, the pitch is different. Hoo, 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 hoo. Okay, there are the winds after the flight. It's about the same. I think the high gust went up a little bit. The average one. But it's not bad. Let's check the battery. Have to look at the video to see the flight because I shut my radio off. 
Wow, 45%. 45%. And those of you that like cells, there's a min max. Me. There's a cell, 38, 32, 441. Got one cell that's lagging a little bit. There you go, 42% left on a four cell battery. That isn't bad at all. Hoo 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 hoo.